हेलो हेलो गाइस गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीवन दिस इज सौरभ एंड आई एम योर ट्रेनर फॉर परफॉर्मेंस टेस्टिंग एंड आई एम ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ यू क्लास सो स्पीकिंग अबाउट आवर लास्ट क्लास वी हैड एनहांस्ड वन स्क्रिप्ट एंड वी हैड वी हैव इवन सीन वी आर वी आर चेकिंग आउट रन टाइम सेटिंग सो बिफोर दैट आई वांटेड टू टेल यू आई आई विल बी कंटिन्यूइंग विद वन मोर स्क्रिप्ट टुडे विद अ डिफरेंट फ्लो and we'll uh, we'll even see that thing also so we'll check it today we'll record that thing so it is also a good flow let us check that thing ah uh, please demo so this is a website uh a flight booking website so this is the launch part and let us just explore this website first okay email address register first of all what we will do we'll try to register uh, and the thing then we'll go to login we'll log in and so let's see just for now i'll just try to travel wonder wonder email address is travel dot wonder at the rate xyz dot com password is Just copy this number. Okay, why is it not working? Okay, I think this website is not working. So what we'll do? We'll not focus on this thing. We'll just explore this thing. Uh, let us a person is moving from Paris to London. Find flight. and here he needs to select a airline in which which particular airline and what time it is flexible for him to choose a flight and he has to give a name travel wonder uh, let's 1 2 3 4 5 5 city is new york state is New York and zip code is one two three four five six. It is a dummy dummy website. You can take anything. I'm taking one 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 two 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 three 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 four 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 four. And I'll name as John's Travel Wonder Travel Wonder. Such as right. so here you had taken a purchase and now you have to check okay i wanted to give you a very good example like i wanted to explain this particular scenario okay no worries 
we'll just try to continue with this thing Okay, I'll open this new script solution web HTTP. So here I'll, as I have told you earlier, I'll mention BP06. Give my application name Blaze Demo, and now purchase ticket and create. Here I'll be explaining with different WebRest A param. In the last one I had done with WebRest A param. Now I'll focus more on other thing as well. WebRest A param underscore ex. So in this session also you learn a lot, and we'll try to explore some few functions. First of all, uh, this is the record button. I don't want to select this. I'll select Google Chrome, remove it, copy this thing and close it and paste it. Okay, so I'll, I'll start recording. So once this thing is started, I just comment launch so that whatever it is getting recorded it will be captured Sorry, let me just cancel this thing. I think it is not allowing me to do here. Record, copy the thing, select one more browser, paste it, start recording. You can add a comment, launch ask me later so it is launched so here I wanted to go select Mexico City my departure city and my the city is New York and I want to find click find flight in the previous class also I did explain this thing you have to add a comment it will help you to identify which particular request and transaction to name a transaction okay so based on your flexibility choose any flight i'm selecting select virgin america airline okay choose the flight let us fill the details Uh, first name is Steve and address Australia Canberra okay cities Canberra on state is first state I don't know consider Australia only The code is 456 visa credit card is 1111 2222 16 digit number and 
Steven Smith is my name. So I'll just before that what I'll do, I'll do click purchase flight. Okay. Okay, let me just close this thing. I think this is a very small script. Not as big as earlier one. I wanted to give you and show you in this example. I uh, wanted to explore much on dynamic request. How can you handle dynamic request? I'll uh, just see and come to you like in the next class. So here you have to type the host, create a parameter, replace create a parameter, e underscore host. Replace all Okay, so first one is launch. Copy this thing. Enter. Save it. Here you have to. There is extra is like any extra extra URLs and. Normally, I, I also explain what is the difference between web URL and web submit data and web underscore link. This all, how can you handle and what what is the actual meaning of this thing? I'll explain in the later class. So I'll even explain in this class about the whole runtime setting after this completion of the script and even next we'll follow with. This particular regenerating and this particular recording option. So we'll look at each by each one after other. So first of all, we'll develop the script. In the previous class, we I have already told you we have to put a text check to average find name of the text. then save count it, it, it counts how what is the amount of uh, what is the time this particular text has appeared in this page and fail if not found and this is the last of the attribute and put a semicolon save count i'll give a name of this particular save count text underscore count txt and look at this particular snapshot so if you find there is no snapshot here go to view and add a the uh, shortcut key is control alt p control alt p see this particular snapshot is available now and now copy this response body We'll find a unique text check. So for that, we'll go to the Notepad plus plus because again this won't be feasible. Oh, 
okay now we got blaze demo is our title and let us just find out some of the unique text what we can see in this particular website uh, destination of the week let me just copy this thing copy and search it see i got this particular copy this is unique david next what i told add a start transaction and end transaction so for that directly we are not utilizing that thing so we'll take lr save string here we'll give a bp06 is a business process then blaze demo is the application then scenario is purchase ticket then you have to give a transaction t001 underscore launch comma where we'll assign we'll give a name txn underscore name injection name and now we store this particular value in this particular transaction name and how we can retrieve it with a lr start injection now we'll use one more eval string whenever we wanted to convert any lr we are able to c string we will use this particular function and here we have to in this particular curly braces we have to mention this name copy and save so here again if if whatever is uh, we are not getting it then if it is uh, last time what i told if it is coming more than that it let us pass now we'll check if it is coming less than that we will fail it first or else we'll continue the same process itself we'll take a to i a to i is for uh, conversion to any integer so We'll convert the LR variable into string. So LR eval string and text count. Greater than zero. okay let me just put lr and transaction lr equal string for the transaction name txn name comma lr underscore pass else we will copy this thing paste 
LR exit We'll just fail this thing. We'll search for LR exit. LR underscore exit. So we'll go to M one. We'll search LR exit. So we'll see LR exit status, LR pass, LR fail, LR auto, and LR exit, exit the script action or iteration. LR exit action and continue. LR exit iteration and continue. So we can take this particular thing. We can take LR exit iteration and continue or LR exit action and continue. So there are different uh, fields you can put LR exit main iteration and continue LR exit iteration and continue change between version 8.0 this option can be configured uh, in this run options main iteration underscore exit LR exit main iteration and continue so we will just see this particular example now We'll see the example. We'll copy this. And we can even print an error message also. LR error message. So F1 key here this helps this will print in this particular error message format so whatever you wanted to print in this particular output console we can copy it suppose we wanted to copy this thing and we'll change accordingly copy this thing unable to launch And we can mention uh, this particular error as well. Error evil string. We can mention error occurred at Transaction 
you can mention this particular transaction mention copy this thing and time what time will create a time parameter p underscore date time copy date time now here we'll select each occurrence close paste what is the iteration it's failing